Lincoln really likes this book. Every time I read it to him, I can feel him bopping around in there. But he pretty much likes every book so far, I think. Baby update time, you know? So, um, walk in here all dramatically. See the big old bump, the big belly? The, um, yeah. It's funny because the cover photo on the YouTube channel is Chris and I doing a baby update on Touching the Belly, and it's so much smaller than it is right now. Yeah, it's, it's pretty big. Oh, gosh. I have to like do yoga first thing in the morning now because I'm starting to get like so sore when I sleep. I got the body pillows. It's just. Whew. Well, also she does no longer have a belly button. It has disappeared. <laughs> I don't know if I can ate it or what. I Where'd it go? Um, did you like Chris's new haircut? Oh yeah. <laughs> she got a new haircut. So, um, but once every. <laughs> once every like four to five months. Yeah. Yeah. It works. It works. but Because <laughs> I, I like it a couple different lengths. So I get to enjoy it at like a medium length. And then like this is usually about the shortest. I really like that. I really like her haircut um, right now. I like it that length. It's Thanks. like perfect. It you is. did a good job this time. Thank you. Yeah. I looked at pictures. And, and, I, yeah. and I liked it longer layers to the front so I could put pretties in it. Well, now the only problem for me is finding world bobby pins all over the house. Yeah, I had to get more. There's so many. But they're, most of them are scattered around the house in places that shouldn't well, be. I like to, to kind of make an Easter egg hunt with the bobby pins. Okay, well, anyway, enough about that. It's been a while since you've seen Kristen, I think, a few vlogs. Think so. Earlier this week, I did a vlog titled, Am I Ready to Be a Dad? And I really talked about, like, all the things I'm looking forward to and how um, it's, you know, going to be a new, crazy, exciting adventure. And it's time for a baby update. What week is it? It's week 29. Week 29. We are already two weeks. This is the second week of the third trimester. And Lincoln is somewhere between like 15 and a half inches to about 16 something. Mm -hmm. And somewhere between about two and a half pounds to maybe about three and a half to four. He's so like, I just have a feeling, okay, two things, two predictions I'm gonna make right now. One, in, one, he's gonna be ex like energetic child. And two, he's coming early. I just have a feeling. I just not feel too it in my early. bones. And that, but I mean, he's gonna be here before May 11th. I just feel it in my bones. Yeah, I kind of get that opinion too. I feel like that he's gonna, this is just our prediction, Lincoln. I feel like he's gonna be a really sweet boy, like I said, because every time that I that I start to feel a little bit nervous, I haven't felt him, and I put my feet up, and like, well, hi, he just did that. He just <laughs> knows I'm a little bit nervous. He gives me a little kick. He's yeah. just a sweet boy. He's energetic. He's bopping around in there. <laughs> oh, sorry. I, I am getting over a slight cold. Which is weird because getting a cold, like, so I've been eating like crazy super healthy the past like six months, basically just fruits and vegetables, like plant-based. We've been it's, vegan for like- It's any, actually been almost eight months. Eight months, yeah. So when I get a cold now, it used to be like when I ate like crap. And look, I ate like crap. It wasn't just that I used to eat meat and dairy. Like I ate like crap and I had like just junk food, chips, whatever. And I would get the regular three week cold, right? The week of it coming in, the week of it being there, and the week of it going out. Mm -hmm. Now it's just like a runny nose for a day, and then like a stuffy nose for a day, and then it's out of town. Nice. So, anyway, I got the. the okay, we've picked a middle name for Lincoln. Yeah, you're good with you're I'm good, good with it. it. Yeah, we went back and forth. His name is gonna be Lincoln Danger Thane. No. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> what is his middle name really gonna be? You tell him since it's yours. Okay, since it's mine. Well, I mean, that's, it was one that you really, really wanted, so. It was, okay. Mm -hmm. So we've decided on Lincoln James Thane. Lincoln James, can you scoot up a little bit? Okay, okay. I just stay back there in the shadows the whole time. <laughs> lurking around, but Lincoln James <laughs> Thane, um, like I said, we have many family names, but it's spe spe that. specifically special because it's after my grandpa, um, James. Mm -hmm. It's like a family name on her side, so yeah. we thought, yeah, it sounds it sounds good, and um, uh, just, yeah, Lincoln James 
thing. I mean, it only is gonna come up when I'm yelling at him or he has to get a passport. So that's, I mean, I feel like that's really the only time that it comes up. Now, on his birth certificate, I may or may not, in parentheses, write danger after like, uh, James. That's to be determined later. You can call him that if you want. No, I'll have a birth certificate. It'll be legally binding. So anyway, moving Except that on. I signed the birth certificate well, last, so. Yeah, well, leave it, well, moving on. We'll, pin, we'll, pin, pin, we'll put a pin in it. Okay, moving on. Um, it is my last, well, Friday was my birthday, and it's my last birthday without a child. Yeah. And it's dawned on me. Like, I mean, all now everything is the last. A, a new, a last and a new beginning. So this time next year, it'll be Lincoln zipping around the house, crawling around and mm -hmm. doing whatever babies do. And so it's really kind of surreal, I think. Yeah. And it's 28 weeks, you say 29 weeks? 29 weeks. 29 weeks. We have an ultrasound coming up in two? Ba basically like two and a half weeks, yeah. And we'll see his face, hopefully. Yeah. See his face. And then we got a, uh, a birthing class coming up on Thursday, right? Yeah, first of two. It's about three hours long. Yeah, we're going to learn about all sorts of fun things like um, how to, when to know to go to the hospital, what to pack, like, you know, uh, breastfeeding for baby first aid. So. I'm, I'm looking forward to it. I want to see if I can film some of it, just to kind of film the experience of us going. Maybe, you know, we'll see. But I'm, I'm really excited because um, I here's the plan. So here's the plan. On the day that he's born, it's gonna be like this. Okay, so I'm putting these positive vibes out there. We're gonna wake up, eat our breakfast, and you know, go about our day. And around, we'll eat and just you know, get it ready, get ready, get ready. And about lunchtime, we'll eat lunch and we'll start an episode of something on Netflix. Oh, I'm going into labor, says Kristen. And then we'll pause the Netflix show. We'll go have ourselves a baby, and then we'll come home in time for supper. Finish our Netflix show. Three of us. Kyle's convinced that he can like speak this to the baby be to Lincoln because mm -hmm. um, he coached Lincoln to show his um, man parts. Yeah, you listen here, pal. Um, you're gonna be head first, right? Slip right out of there, and uh, we're gonna come back and finish our Netflix show and uh, eat some food. And also, um, uh, the doctor's gonna let me catch you right on out of there. Get out, wrap. All right, like a football. You know, and I'm gonna do the. I think you have to do the Heisman. No, I'm gonna do Lion King thing when he comes out. Oh, okay. I'm gonna scrub in. <clears throat> you might have to put something over your beard. <laughs> <laughs> scrub in all up. But anyway, yeah, just exciting times. We're getting close to a lot of things. The uh, registry, May 11th. No. The know. baby shower. Sorry. Baby shower, March 11th. Coming up. Yeah. Pretty excited, actually. Exactly two weeks from today. Yes. Getting some stuff for Lincoln. Most of everything, a lot of our stuff's been picked up. A lot of our stuff has been picked so, up. So, that'll be nice. I think that within the next couple weeks, we're gonna go to um, Babies R Us and just kinda like look to see that we have a good, some good bottles and pacifiers for him. Um, I am feeling less, I'm feeling more and more crowded. Mm, and less and less sense. like me and more and more like um, a pod person. A pod person, she says. Or, you know, okay. like a host. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, but overall, it's still pretty good. Just more, just more tired. Starting to get more sore. Been really lucky. Knock on. I don't know. We have wood over there. Knock, knock, knock. Um, a lot of people say they get really bad heartburn. I haven't had really too much heartburn this semester. 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 <laughs> this trimester. Um, I had, I had some, some in the first trimester. Um, I still have. I've got nausea back, but it's not so much at the smells. It's just like at taste certain things. I just like no. I'm like nope. Can't do it. Mm-hmm. So yeah, that's that. You know, hey, that's that's what's going on right now. Got some exciting stuff coming up. I'm looking forward to down the pipeline. And Lincoln is growing in strength and power, and might. Oh. And determination. So I kind of this is one of the reasons that I got this balloon for Kyle for Valentine's Day because we talked about that there's a battle for the what force Lincoln will um, get his powers from if it will be the dark side or the light side. So that's kind of an inside story about that. <laughs> we'll see what happens. But uh, anyways, thanks for joining us. We love you so very much. Find your gift. Share it with the world. And remember, you are worth it. See you tomorrow. <laughs>